Hi everybody, it's Galactic Man Larry here again with another Marvel Legends figure review and today we have in front of us from the West Coast Avengers the Scarlet Witch from the Retro Wave and this is the one that used to come in this other packaging which I never opened so I don't know, I'm thinking about should I sell this I mean I, this I only have this Magneto and this Quicksilver, so at the end I won't think I sell it, or at least not for now. And yeah, this is the the new figure, well the same figure, but this is the new color scheme, and the faces are actually different. This is the old style face painting, and this is the new, like with digitally applied, like the photo reel. The artwork in this one, I don't really enjoy it, I think it's one of the weaker ones. For me at least there's yeah from the ones I have at least is the one I like the least which I don't know uh, I mean I think she doesn't look as pretty as the figure and yeah Scarlet Witch finds her heartbreak turned into horror when she encounters her husband win vision revealed with no memory of their love and there you have her, the Scarlet Witch, out of the packaging, looking amazing. Yeah, well, I, 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 look, I like how she looks. The only thing I'm not liking is how wobbly this leg is, but, well, it's the way it is for now. Uh, I'll see how, if, and how I could fix that, maybe, I don't know. But yeah, the that face sculpt is is the selling point of this figure I mean and yeah the color maybe for some people maybe some people prefer the metallic one some people maybe prefer also this one but I mean that's more like the the I remember her like this with this like this tiara yeah maybe this is the right one I don't know which one is the right one but this is the look I remember more but uh, this is the face I like more from the current sculpts and something I just wanted to check I mean the bodies are the same just the only thing that changes is of course the colors the way they're painted and that this one has those uh, high heels that make her hard to stand but I have this uh, stand and problem solved but something I want to check yeah as you guessed that's why I w what I wanted to check and I think this is how I keep him I'm keeping her this is the way I want to have my Scarlet Witch, not this, I mean, this is, it's the same body again, but just look the difference that uh, the skin tone there makes, I mean, this is how I'm keeping her. And the bodies are the same, so I mean, we will go through this body, you can see the articulation wise, is the body is not new at all, I don't know from what year this body is, but it has to be at least like six, seven or more years old, I don't know, and I don't know if this is the the original character, I mean this body with this head but uh, yeah, the, well, the articulation is very straightforward you just can lift the arms up to like to T-pose you have a single jointed elbow that cannot even do 90 degrees the, the new one, actually I, I'm looking at the old one and the arms are not the same but we're checking the new body and then we're checking the let's say the old one uh, yeah I have this this arm from the Kitty Pride I think I have that Kitty Pride figure from a couple of years ago I think it's from the Wendigo I don't even remember which build a figure but yeah she can kick I think it's a col uh, juggernaut wave that far but look at that very nice I mean the diaphragm can crunch forward that far, can crunch backwards that far, can tilt to the side, which is good, that's a good thing. Of course the cape is it's heavy for this. I had to hit the body, the, the legs were very stiff, I mean the hips, but now that I put her in hot water it's all fine. So she can kick forward that far, she can kick backwards a little bit, because of the sculpt of course, which is very there. Uh, she can do only that much splits she has a thigh cut and the legs can kick that far they're old and pin full and she can the foot the feet can go backwards that far and forward that uh, yeah 
almost nothing and it's a bit obvious that these feet were not made for these legs and well I don't know if it shows yeah all that extra amount of plastic here yeah and you can remove the hand so as you can see I swapped the the effects from the new figure to the to my new kit bash or whatever I mean I just changed the head yeah even if the skin tones are not perfectly matching I just like this one better and I like well she has the the point here which I think is the accurate way I don't know uh, people were pointing that in some other people's feeds or channels or some somewhere uh, now this one that has those high heels the heels are yeah very limited so she can just do a little bit I mean if I if you play around maybe you can go a bit over those limitations but yeah of course these are won't be the most dynamic feet but I like the look and uh, these arms which are different have a much deeper cut there so they can go over 90 degrees and I like and appreciate that and there you have Scarlet Witch next to Scarlet Witch and Scarlet Witch from the MCU I mean this just that you remember this is the new body just I swapped the heads and gave her the effect parts I just like the look better here she is next to Doctor Strange and the Sleepwalker next to Tigra, Black Widow, Wasp and Captain Carter next to Captain America, Iron Man and Thor next to Thanos, the Red Skull and Baron Simo and next to some other people with questionable wardrobes as well as questionable life habits so that's it for this review, I hope you enjoyed it uh, that it helped you decide if you want to get this figure with that head <laughs> and you should get then that figure with this head so that you can make the swap as well so please leave a like and subscribe to the channel uh, I will be very thankful if you do so and more content is on its way as well as you can see the over 130 videos that I have already uploaded so I will see you in the next one ciao 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 take care